Hi, this video is about the Caribou Mathematics Contest in Canada. I'm going to show you the solution for the January 2012 Grade 3 4 contest, Question 9, which also came up in the Grade 5 6 and 7 8 contests. So, the question is. When 100 seeds are planted, 80 start to grow, and each that grows has 5 flowers. How many seeds need to be planted to have 200 flowers? Well, if we know that 80 start to grow, and each that grows has 5 flowers, we would do 80 times 5, which is 400 flowers. So 400 flowers start to grow when 100 seeds are planted. But we need 200 flowers, so we need to figure out how many seeds need to be planted. Well, if we know that 200 is half of 400, then we would just do 100 divided by 2, which is 50. So we know the answer is 50 seeds. But there is a more formal way to solve this type of problem. So what if we had a completely different number of flowers, like for instance 240? Well, the ratio between the number of seeds and the number of flowers will always stay the same. And that is 100 seeds divided by 400 flowers. But we need 200 flowers. So, and we want to find out how many seeds need to be planted. So let's call that x. So, now we can divide by 100 in the numerator and the denominator so that we have one seed over four flowers. So in order to get x equals, we need to multiply by 200 flowers. So we have x equals 1 seed over 4 flowers times 200 flowers. So now we can cancel out the flowers because we don't need them anymore. And what we have left is one quarter of a seed times 200, which equals 50 seeds. So the answer is 50 seeds need to be planted to grow 200 flowers. If you'd like to know more about this contest, please feel free to visit our website at www.brocky.ca slash caribou.